happening on YouTube. So I was just in here, and these crypts are really growing across here, so you can see some of the roots. I uh, decided to pull part of it out, and the water's a little muggy now because I pulled one of these plants out. This is a dirted tank, um, so all that dirt's get into it. It'll soon clean out now. Won't take long. So I'll have this light on a lot longer now, and the crypts really taken off. See, it's at the top of the water line now. And you come around here, like it's nearly the width of the tank. So I decided to pull a bit out. So come with me. I just threw the stairs. Let's see, getting some better light. So. What we've got a real nice piece, it's good, it's healthy. So that's what we've got. Let's see if we can get on to something better like a chair. So, real long roots, it's a really healthy plant, real big. So, I just pulled it in the plant out of that tank. I don't want to leave something chopped off, but it's, it's been growing for a while. Right here. I thought I'd show you how my plants are doing. As you can see, pretty well. That's from a dirty tank. So, and it was dosed with CO2 for a while, for about, I don't know, a week or so. I guess about a week or so, it really took off. So I'm gonna now transfer this plant into my four foot tank. Yeah, put up a four foot tank, see how it goes. Might roll back though. Um, might trim these roots a little bit, but these roots are amazing, as you can see. I don't really wanna to cut too much off them. So, so I'll show you what I pull up. I had to tear up half the tank nearly just to get this out. I actually had to break the roots off, so there's actually more of it in. I'd say there's a good bit more of it lying in there. So, really good rootage, good plant. I'll put it in my other tank now and see how it goes. And hope for the best. So, thanks for watching, guys.